The Klein Shell is an oil shell formation that is 140 miles long by 70 miles wide, and it stretches from Stonewall County in the north to Erion County in the south. The shell has oil deposits that were too difficult to access before new drilling technology called hydraulic fracturing came into play. Now, the Klein Shell is being considered as one of the country's hottest spots to drill. An influx of oil has caused much more activity in the Barnhart area, and as far north as Colorado City, they're seeing action and rigs moving in. There is speculation that the formation could contain as much as 30 billion barrels of oil, and that is something that is attracting big oil companies to the area. The Klein Shale boom has created a focus on San Angelo for support for people who are moving here to take those jobs. Brandon Barnes works for Original Services. They provide everything a drilling rig needs outside of the rig from housing, electricity and transfer pumps and he says recently business has been booming. We've always we constantly have people running out to the field either running equipment out to the rigs or bringing them off the rigs, shuffling equipment between rigs because it doesn't, our equipment hardly has a chance to even get back to the yard now. It, if it's released by one rig, it's moving to another one that's moving in, or it's uh, released by one that's getting off of a hole, it's going on another one that's going to a hole. So I mean, we, have, we rarely have equipment sitting in our yard these days. In the last two years, we've added equipment employees. We've gone from two employees to 23 employees. Our revenue has grown eight times what it was two years ago. The energy companies moving to our part of the state will play a big part in our local economy. New businesses are opening up or adding second locations like this discount tire behind me that's scheduled to open towards the end of April. Well the chamber's been very busy in the last several months working with energy related businesses, uh, the primary and the contractors coming with those. And with those jobs being created here, there are, for every two or three jobs created in a primary industry like energy, there are jobs created in the private sector to support those. So what you're seeing right now are a lot of businesses that are coming to support the, the primary energy industry. But Phil says our economy will stay diverse and that it won't just solely rely on the oil boom. One of the things that you note when there is growth going on is that you seem to get overbuilt in some areas and then it levels out and then you don't see that kind of growth for a while and what you're going to see in the next uh, few years here are growth in service industries, retail. In fact, Phil says in the next few months there will be the announcement of several new hotels and motels coming to town and new apartment complexes being built.